And the second umbilical now retracting. Engine sequence has started. Engines coming up to flight speed. T minus six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold down arms retracted, and we have liftoff of the 93 Progress resupply ship to the International Space Station. The Soyuz booster has cleared the tower. Twenty seconds into the flight, all parameters are normal. Roll pitch and yaw program are in. The booster arcing out to the northeast over the Central Asian desert. 35 seconds into the flight, good first stage performance uh, reported from the blockhouse in Baikonur. Good stable vehicle performance. All engine parameters are in normal range. The combustion pressure is nominal on the first stage. One minute, five seconds into the flight. Yaw, pitch, and roll all reported to be nominal from the blockhouse in Baikonur. Coming up on maximum dynamic pressure on the Soyuz booster, one minute, 30 seconds into the flight. One minute, 40 seconds into the flight, all vehicle parameters reported to be normal. Standing by for first stage separation. And we have first stage separation. Strap on boosters falling away. Second stage now in control. Two minutes, 14 seconds into the flight. Everything reported to be normal. Good trajectory on the Soyuz booster. All structural parameters are reported to be normal from the blockhouse in Baikonur. Two minutes, 35 seconds into the flight. Just over six minutes of powered flight remaining. Good reports coming back from the blockhouse in Baikonur as we approach the three minute mark into the flight. Good stability on the vehicle, good engine performance from the second stage. Confirmation now of the jettisoning of the launch shroud that has enveloped uh, the progress itself. Three minutes, 27 seconds into the flight. Three minutes, 40 seconds into the flight, a little over five minutes of powered flight remaining. Good reports coming back on vehicle performance. The flight is reported to be right down the line, right on the pre-launch parameters for the trajectory of the Soyuz booster. And now we're getting video from the camera on the upper stage of the Soyuz booster. Four minutes, 10 seconds into the flight. Yaw, pitch and roll, all reported to be normal. Good uh, structural stability on the Soyuz booster. Four minutes, 30 seconds into the flight. Coming up on second stage shutdown and jettisoning.
And we have second stage shutdown, second stage jettison. Third stage up and running, the third stage skirt was just jettisoned as you saw. Five minutes, 10 seconds into the flight, about three minutes and 40 seconds of powered flight remaining. The vehicle uh, reported to have good stability, good structural support. Good third stage uh, performance reported uh, from Baikonur. We are five minutes, 45 seconds into the flight, a little over three minutes of powered flight remaining. This uh, third stage engine providing about 30 tons of thrust for the duration of its burn, we're expecting third stage shutdown at about the eight minute, 46 second mark into the flight, about uh, two and a half minutes from now. Good yaw, pitch and roll. Six minutes, 47 seconds into the flight, two minutes of powered flight remaining. Everything looking good on the Soyuz booster. Had a momentary loss of uh, video from the third stage camera on the Soyuz. That uh, view is now back as we hit the seven minute, 15 second mark into the flight, about one and a half minutes of powered flight remaining. Third stage engine continues to hum along in good shape. Good stability on the vehicle, seven and a half minutes into the flight. Good structural parameters being reported by the engineers in Baikonur as we approach the eight minute mark into the flight. Eight minutes, 10 seconds into the flight. We're about 40 seconds away from uh, third stage shutdown and spacecraft separation. Eight and a half minutes into the flight. So far, so good for the Soyuz booster. We are standing by for third stage shutdown and spacecraft separation. And third stage shutdown now confirmed. And third stage separation.